Do you want to give us your, it'd be great to hear your name and where you're from and what brings you here. I'm uh, Gerd Peter Bruch. I'm French. Uh, I'm an activist and I'm a filmmaker, founder of uh, Planet Amazon, member of the Alliance of Mother Nature's Guardians, executive committee member, and uh, my heart is indigenous. Okay, and, and what brings you to Montreal? You. <laughs> you brings me here. <laughs> now I want to be here to defend ecocide and uh, to defend the idea that it's connected to the protection of the Amazon. It has to be connected. It's completely connected. Um, I've been seeing for more than 30 years the, uh, the, the work that has been done being destroyed, in fact, because some work has been done. But it's like people, you know, don't remember. The decision makers don't want to remember, they know. But uh, I'm talking about uh, the media and the rest of the world. They don't remember that uh, the way that we, uh, we can protect the Amazon is um, rec recognizing, demarcating indigenous territories. But, to, but we have seen recently that it's not enough. That is not enough. Uh, Bolsonaro, in just four years, has proven to any of us that um, decades of work can be destroyed like that, just like that. And we did not have a law to, to protect the indigenous territory. So just him coming to power with the same constitution recognizing uh, indigenous territories, that was not enough. So there were a lot of invasions. A lot of uh, uh, indigenous people were assassinated. Uh, a great part of, of indigenous territories were attacked, under attack. A part of the forest were, uh, were, was burned. So we didn't have nothing to, to avoid that, to prevent that, or even now. If we should have, if we would have had that law, we could just come back to the destroyer and say, you're going to be on court for the crime of ecocide. Meaning that it's not just enough to, first, we have to achieve what has been started and stopped uh, during the, the Bolsonaro administration meaning we have to demarcate all indigenous territories. It has to go with something stronger, meaning that a law that can effectively protect the indigenous territories. So demarcation plus ecocide law would be fantastic. And can you tell us a little bit about why it is so important to protect indigenous territories and what is the connection between protecting indigenous territories and also protecting the Amazon rainforest? Biodiversity, we are, we are losing, I don't know, it's, a, it's just so strange that I have to explain that, but just we are talking about the living world. We're doing a film that uh, is called uh, Amazonia, the heart of Mother Earth. It is exactly that. It's the heart. Uh, a body n cannot function with, uh, without a heart. So the heart is under attack, is uh, sick at the moment. We have to protect the heart of the living world, the forest. The Amazon is a symbol. It's not only that forest that has to be protected, the, mm -hmm. the other ecosystem as well. Uh, they are all interconnected. Uh, that is very important because we are losing all, everything now. We are part of nature. We are not different and nature is being destroyed. And we don't realize that it's like, it reminds me like the, all these very important uh, uh, quotes that we know from indigenous people that uh, it's only when the last river would have been destroyed and the last fish uh, would have been uh, killed that we are going to realize that we can't eat money. So it's exactly that. We are at that point. And uh, if we don't save the Amazon, you know, that should be the focus. That should be the focus. You know, the, the, the only focus would be saving uh, the Amazon, saving the oceans. But there are only discussion about how can we implement the Paris Agreement, seven years of being trying to implement each line, and there's no plan to save the Amazon. So meaning that let's do a plan to demarcate all indigenous territories. President Lula will need the help of you know, a great mobilization, uh, a global mobilization, because it's a global issue. And let's really make the ecocide become a law globally. Thank you. I think that felt like a good place to stop, actually. It was really rounded off. I hope that worked. Yeah, <laughs>